Senior Senate Democrats are interested in making another attempt at eliminating or altering the filibuster now that their party's two biggest opponents to the change, Kirsten Cinema and Joe Manchin, are retiring. I hope that we uh, will use this opportunity uh, to take a hard look at the Senate rules. The filibuster has dramatically changed the United States Senate for the worse. Uh, we are no longer a deliberative, uh, mandatory body, and it's because of the filibuster. And uh, I miss it. I remember the days when it was uh, a fulsome bipartisan chamber. In addition to a total elimination, there are options to alter the filibuster. That includes requiring a talking filibuster or placing restrictions on the type of legislation it can be used for. Because Senator Sinema essentially opposed changing the filibuster, now we may have a majority in favor of reforming this set of rules which is obstructive, really an obstacle to progress that the American people want. The majority should rule in the United States Senate. The minority shouldn't be able to block us. Republicans are unified in their stance that the 60 vote threshold must remain. Senator Lindsey Graham told SAN that it has served the Senate well. I've been for preserving it when it was not to my advantage. If you want the Senate to become the House, it'd be a bad, bad decision. The last attempt to end the filibuster was in January 2022, when Democrats were trying to pass the John Lewis Voting Rights Act. The legislation did not have sufficient support due to Republican opposition, so Senator Schumer attempted to move it forward by making what's called a point of order, which required a simple majority vote of approval. It failed 52 to 48 because Senators Manchin and Sinema voted against it, along with every Republican. Straight Arrow News asked Majority Leader Chuck Schumer if he would make another attempt at ending the filibuster once Manchin and Sinema leave. He referred to the voting rights bill in his answer. When people attempt to, to courts or legislators take away voting rights, particularly of the most disenfranchised people, we have an obligation to do everything we can to restore those voting rights. If Democrats are going to make any changes, they'll need to maintain their majority. But because Cinema and Manchin are leaving, that has become more difficult. We have a story explaining why at SAN.com.